So my wife, Andrea, texted me earlier today saying, happy Perfect Squares Day. And I was so busy and caught up in my work that I hadn't even stopped to look at the date today of 9-16-2025 to see that, yes, it is, in fact, Perfect Squares Day because 9 is 3 squared, 16 is 4 squared, and the year 2025 is 45 squared. But as it turns out, not only is today Perfect Squares Day, but it's also Pythagorean Theorem Day because if you drop the 20 from 2025, 25 is equal to 5 squared. And if you take the 3 squared plus the 4 squared and add that up, it totals the 25 of 5 squared. That means that 3, 4, and 5, since they work together in the Pythagorean theorem formula, that means that these are a Pythagorean triple, which makes them a set of three possible integers that could represent the three sides of a right triangle. So that's why it's also Pythagorean Theorem Day. So that's definitely cool on top of it already being Perfect Squares Day. What's admittedly not so cool is the fact that this Perfect Square Day is actually the next to last one that any of us are going to see in our lifetimes, or almost any of us, because... If you look at it, the next perfect square day, the last one that's really going to exist is going to be next Thursday on September 25th, three squared, five squared, and 45 squared. If you want to see another perfect square day beyond this one, you have to find a way to live all the way to January 1st in the year 2116 or 46 squared. Uh, good luck, I guess.